Welcome to EA UFC. Coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Bruce Lee, Matt Hughes. All right, so here he is, one of the better ground and pound guys we have in the sport here at present. There's just an efficiency and an accuracy to the way he approaches the ground strikes. No wasted motion out of this guy. Oh, it's, it's an art form, John. It's the way that he goes at his opponents, and the moment they hit the mat, he secures it. Oh, it's up. He doesn't rush. He takes his time. He knows that it does not take much in order to finish a fight. So he'll find his posture. You can't, he doesn't waste time with his head to chest, just punch him. He finds posture. Once he finds posture, he can get momentum to land the big strikes, then he moves position. And then he goes and he finds another strike. Before long, you see his opponent face swelling. You see the eyes all split open and beat. It's truly, truly amazing to watch him and watch his approach to ground and pound. And great cardio allows him to stay heavy. We've seen a lot of fighters just struggle to buck him off. We'll see how it goes tonight. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, enter Bruce Lee. I mean, that's Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Over and over and over, he did the same thing, and it shows in the technique, because there's no wasted energy. There's no wasted movements. Everything he does, he does with a purpose. He goes in there with an idea of what he's trying to accomplish, and he gets it done. Bruce Lee is the absolute best Bruce Lee is the man. His grappling, his takedown defense figure to be tested here tonight. But there aren't that many guys who are going to want to stand and trade on a napkin in the center of the octagon with the great Bruce Lee. No, if you're fighting Bruce Lee, you're shooting for takedowns right yeah. away. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Eve Loving. This is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold out Prudential Center in Newark, New Jersey. It's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a wrestler, holding a professional record of 45 wins, 9 losses. He stands 5 feet 9 inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Fighting out of Hillsboro, Illinois, presenting the member of the UFC Hall of Fame and the former UFC welterweight champion of the world, Matt Hughes! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Okay, guys, protect yourself at all time, obey my command at all time. If you want to touch love, do it now, go back to your corner. I mean, Damian Maya may be the most specialist type of grappler in the UFC. This guy resembles him in a number of ways. Let's see how he manages this fight against a guy that can do just about everything inside the octagon. Oh, the kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Ooh, head kick lands. He's hurt. 
big ball from punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Real nice body kick lands. into these big leg kicks. Trying to establish that jab once again. Just misses there with the left. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Able to check that kick as well. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Nice punch there by Q. Try to establish that jab. Very Looks like it did stun him a little bit. Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Look at him chopping the wood. He chops the wood with those leg kicks. Missed with that attempt. Jab hurt him. Back as close we go. And he lands a kick to the leg now. Pretty good work on the feet tonight by Hughes. Big kick. Look at the force behind that leg kick. Just missed with the left there. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Just over two minutes to go in what has been a furious round one. He is all about that left kick to the body. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Sniff that one out as he blocks the kick. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Good stick. That is a thudding leg kick. This fight's gonna be over this. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high to the ball going low. Now he's got him hurt very bad. with a right. Oh! And both guys really throwing with authority. Big front lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the latter rounds. Oh, beautiful hook there. Lands a good combination. Hughes' hook to the body now is Like almost every strike found the target. Though. He's so accurate when he decides to attack. It is a sight to behold. Pretty good right hand. Hughes gets hit with a kick. Not there. Ten seconds now to go in the round. Beautiful spinning attack there. All right, so he lands a jab there. Pretty nicely done, DC. You can really control a fight just knowing how to fight behind your jab. Oh, he hurt a bad with a jab. Boom, body kick right there. Landed perfect. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, DC, buckle up. Here we go with our next round. High number of kicks landed in the previous 
round and he'll look to keep it going. He'll look to keep winning the fight with his kicks. He's throwing high kick, leg kick, body kicks. He's even throwing a couple spin kicks in there. This guy is so educated with fighting with his legs. Effective punch there by Hughes. Cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations here. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may float a right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Oh, nice. Nice. Nice straight punch. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. Lee's tough as it gets, but how about the size of that bruise starting to form on his right side? Straight right. There, pretty nice punch there. Great job finding the range to land those punches. Nice leg kick. Oh, good kicks. Oh, it's a beautiful kick right there. I don't know if you've ever been kicked by a mule. Probably feels something like that. Yeah. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's gonna be over very soon. He's hurt! He's hurt! Oh! Look at him drive his shins into his own body with that body kick. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. It's such a fast leg kick. Well, he misses with the left punch there. All right, lands a kick there. Pretty well done. Really good accuracy landing that kick. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. That is such toughness. He should be on his feet right now. Straight punch lands. Trying to double up on that jab. Leg kick. Well, missed on that one. Look at the angle of that nice body. Ooh, huge body shot. And that one was heavy. Man, these guys are throwing back and forth. Well, he continues to offer up the kick here, but just misses with that one. Oh, big head kick lands. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying. Oh, thunderous leg kick rounds his opponent trying to stay upright. But man, that changed the complexion of this fight. Johnny hurt. He's hurt really badly by that one big leg kick. Way to hide that leg kick. Good punch lands. Nice head kick. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, an obvious limp there. His leg hurting for certain. Man, looks like he's trying to set records here, landing all of these strikes. He is aggressive to a fault and really has been all night long as he continues to pour it on. Got to be careful here, though, not to gas out. Look at him whip his hips into that kick. Good body work with that hook by Lee. Oh, nice knee to the body. Very nice. He understands that doing the body work will pay dividends the longer the fight goes. Big head kick lands. Be cautious. Oh, 
right, so it was all about the liver kicks and the body attack in that previous round. DC, the highlight. The liver kick is a nasty kick because it only takes one to land in the perfect spot and it will shut your body down completely. You won't be able to stand. You won't be able to fight. All you want to do is exit the octagon. He better get his elbow down or his opponent's going to continue to take advantage of that weakness. Well, just as he did in the previous round, he continues to connect on a high volume of strikes. And a good sign, too, doesn't seem to be slowing down whatsoever. Nice punch by Lee. Hughes' lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Look at the turtle in that kick. Continues to mix it up, going to the head, mixing in some body shots. He loaded up on that right hand, too. Back and forth we go here! Big leg kick land. Oh, blocks that kick to the body. Nicely done. Well, you didn't see a lot of the body work from him in the earlier rounds, but he's certainly getting after it here. Big shot to the body connects there. We'll see if he can follow it up. Oh, that's a nice strike. Trying to hammer that lead leg. Powerful leg kick lands. Throwing that jab, no good. Nice one, two there. Great punch landed with so much power. Bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Both fighters hanging down. Yeah, it looks a little wobbly on his feet. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh, he might be out. Here's the kick blocked by Hughes. Whoa! What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. We'll finish this fight. This beautiful leg kick throw. Oh, he's landed a high number of total strikes here in the latter stages of this fight. He's really picked up the pace and landing far more strikes than he did in previous rounds. Combination lands for him. It was hard to see a miss in that sequence. He's put it all together. I mean, everything is just flowing. He's like in a zone. It's like the basketball hoop becomes twice his size. This guy today is looking at focus mitts in his opponent. You got to check. Oh! Low leg. He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. Nice leg kick lands. Oh, nice right hand. Both guys landing at a pretty decent clip. Hands high, hands high. Real quick leg kick. Splits the guard, lands the right hand. He's really working over that lead leg with those beautiful leg kicks. And he lands a punch there. Pretty good connection by... Oh! Serve him up. Go get him. That punch, no good. Oh, big elbow. Oh! He's out! He got him! What a fight! You knew if he landed that weapon repeatedly, it could be a short night for his opponent. But that was just one perfectly placed strike that his opponent candidly didn't even see coming. It landed flush, and the rest, as they say, is history. Big knockout win for him here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're gonna get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moments, you gotta show up. 
And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Ian Levine's called a stop to this contest at four minutes, one second of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. So the celebration is on with him and his team, and rightfully so. A monumental result tonight as he gets the win by knockout. He spoke it into existence. He said over and over to anyone that'll listen, I am going to knock this man out. He did it in an even more impressive fashion than he ever could have imagined.